everyone, we're going to evaluate the improper integral or state that it diverges from 0 to 4 and our function is dr divided by square root of 4 minus r. Now we have an infinite discontinuity at 4 because if you substitute in 4 here uh, we get an undefined function. So our interval of our, uh, our f is continuous on 0 to 4 with the infinite discontinuity at the endpoint uh, r equals 4. So let's rewrite this using part b here. This is going to be the limit. As b approaches 4 from the left, and we're going from, um, we're substituting in our 4. So we're putting in b here and 0 there, and then just copy down your integrand and 4 minus r. Now using u substitution, I'll do it on the side here, we'll let u equal um, uh, square root of 4 minus r. So that's just be 4 minus r to the power of 1 half. We'll differentiate u, that's going to be 1 half, 4 minus r to the negative 1 half power times the derivative of negative r, which is negative 1 dr. Uh, don't worry, I'm going to simplify this. You get du equals uh, negative 1 divided by 2 um, square root of 4 minus r. And then we have dr. I'll put this in the numerator. And so finally we have negative du equals dr divided by 2 square root of 4 minus uh, r. So when you write this limit out, we're really going to get the limit as b. Um, we could also cross multiply. This is uh, negative 2 du, sorry, equals dr divided by 2 square root of 4 minus r. Uh, not to 2. I'm just moving this 2 up here. So we have the limit as b uh, approaches 4 from the left. And our, uh, we're going to evaluate it now. Let's rewrite this. When you integrate this, we have negative 2 um, and then negative 2 to u equals this, which is our u. So this, is, uh, this part here is our u, and you're going to write our u as square root of 4 minus r. Now we're evaluating it from b to 0, or 0 to b. And so let's do that. The limit as b approaches uh, 4 from the left, you substitute in b. We're going to get negative 2 times square root of 4 minus b. And then we have minus negative 2 times square root of 4 minus 0. All right, so when you substitute in for your 4, this part's going to be 0. This changes to positive, and then we have uh, 2 times the square root of 2 is 4. So our answer is 4, and it is convergent. We can just put convergence to 4. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.